Hi, welcome back. This is Adventures with Dr. Joe. These are two of the most popular space heaters, portable space heaters, that are sold in the United States. They're made both by Mr. Heater, who has, they have a lot of different products, but these are two of the most popular. This is the Portable Buddy. This is the Hunting Buddy. They are both excellent. They have some differences that I want to share with you, so this is going to be a comparison between two of the most popular Mr. Heater portable uh, heaters that are useful in ground blind, uh, elevated blind, any kind of hunting blind, any ice shanty, uh, anything else that's outdoors that uh, that you're cold in, this these will heat you up. So let's let's take a look at these. Okay, to start out, they both use these one-pound cylinder. Uh, propane liquid propane cylinders that you can buy um, many many places I do have a video on how to refill these successfully if you're interested check it out this cylinder on the portable buddy just sits out here on the outside and they both have a swivel regulator which is that this main unit the main bottle for the hunting buddy is also on a swivel regulator and fits under this enclosure which is really nice they both have swivel handles and they both have a ceramic heating element because these are both radiant heaters. Yes, they heat uh, above it, but they radiate their heat out into the room. This hunting buddy has storage built in for a second bottle, which is really quite nice if you run out with your first one. So that's one big difference. This can heat up to 225 square feet. This heats up to 300 square feet. This has 4,000 and 9,000 BTU because it has two settings, low and high. The Hunting Buddy has 6,000 and 12,000. So we went from 4,000 to 6,000 low, 9,000 to 12,000 BTU on high. They both have tip over protection. If this tips over, it'll shut off, which is a great thing. Both of these do. And they also have an oxygen de depletion sensor so if, if, if you're in an enclosed area and your oxygen saturation in that room goes down these will shut off automatically which is really really nice so let's take a look on how we light these things and take a look at uh, at the pilot lights the hunting buddy is bigger it's considerably bigger and of course heavier but you get a lot more with this if that's what you want if you want the smallest unit this is the way to go Let's, let's light them both up and take a look at the differences. The retail prices for these are quite different. Retail 165, retail 246, so obviously a lot more expensive. But it's bigger and it comes with a number of features. This has a piezoelectric ignition. When you bring it to the pilot, push that button. This has an electronic battery operated ignition. Let's, let's fire this one up first up close and I'll show you how that works. Okay, so you push and turn this to the pilot. Push it down halfway to put some gas in this area and then you hit the ignition. I've already turned this on, that's why it lights so easily. Uh, but you need to check it out. And by the way, before hunting season or before you really need these things, fire them up uh, at your house to be sure everything is good to go. So that's how this starts with this piezoelectric ignition. And then to heat it up, we push down and turn. Typically, I push down and turn to high. And you can see this will light up, and the heater it will come. I'm going to turn the lights off so you can see it. So you can clearly see it glowing. This is on the high setting, and then you rotate it here, and that's at the low setting. Typically, I like to run it on the high setting for a few minutes or for a minute, and then I run it, then I turn it to the low because otherwise it makes more noise. And, about, and by the way, the clicking that this makes when you turn, when you push down the PCO electric lighter, may be something of concern. And as a hunter, you're trying to be quiet. That loud click, I think it can be heard for a considerable distance, so it's something to consider. So here we go: high, low and then just pilot light. The hunting buddy is different. Behind this enclosure is a button. And you can, well, I don't know if you can hear it, but 
there's a clicking sound, which is the uh, battery-powered ignition right down here. So we'll turn this to pilot. And you can push down to give it a little more juice. There it goes. And there it goes. So that's how the pilot works. Again, just to review, let's turn it off. So pilot light, we push down and rotate it to the pilot light, push the PZO, push the button, and if we need a little more juice, we just push this and it gives it a little extra. Then once we're here, we could go, I go immediately to the high setting, let that sit for a minute, I'm going to turn off the lights. And you can see the ceramic heater starting to glow, and boy, it's already radiating a lot of heat. I leave it on high for just a minute. Then you can typically turn it on low, and it's quiet. So there's low, there's high. And this puts out a lot of heat in an enclosed space. Even on low, you only need it for a few minutes, and then I turn it back down. Usually, I usually turn it off just to save propane. So this was a review and a comparison of the Hunting Buddy and the Portable Buddy. Both very nice units, but with some significant differences. Again, PZO lighter, you have to click it. Battery-powered electronic lighter, you just have to push the button. This has its primary cylinder enclosed, as well as a secondary cylinder ready to go right here. They both have tip over protection, uh, low oxygen protection, a nice folding handle that's very comfortable. Uh, and they both work extremely well. Uh, but there are some differences. Greater capacity, very quiet. A little smaller capacity makes that clicking sound. To me, that was the one issue that prompted me to get the hunting buddy. But they're both great. They both work well. Uh, and I'd recommend, I've used them both and they, I recommend them both very highly. So this was my review of the Portable Buddy and the Hunting Buddy, both by Mr. Heater. Both great. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you found it su successful and helpful. Please click like. It helps the channel a lot. And consider subscribing. Thank you very much.